After the Grand Canyon, we head north through Navajo country into a town called Cameron. The town was desolate, but we needed gas on our way to Lake Powell. Check it out, coming up next. In different circumstances, I may try to explore this abandoned hotel, but I had the kids with me, and I didn't think it was a good idea. So we stopped for gas, got some snacks, and got our butts back on the road. After a long time of driving, we hit Horseshoe Bend. No, it's a lot to take in. It's designed to know when, don't wait. Don't be scared when the way paralyzes you straight at the gate. Horseshoe Bend is one of the most scenic stops in Arizona. You can walk right up to the edge of the cliff. Or you can play it safe and stay behind the bar. Well, the jaunt from Horseshoe Bend to Lake Powell was short, if you know where you're going. You have to drive over the dam. Which is also a scenic drive. And getting into Lake Powell, you have to pay a fee to get into it because it is considered a national park. We would set up camp right in the national park and we would have, as you can see, a very good view of the scenic Lake Powell. We decided to fish. What we were fishing for, I have no idea. I don't even think we got a bite, but we had fun doing it. Cam was, as you can tell, very patient. And we thought we might have had a bite. But it turned out that we didn't catch anything. But we had a good time. So, we didn't catch anything, but it is our first day. We'll be coming out tomorrow morning. We got a little big, big bite from a catfish. Well, we weren't sure what it was, but we're determining that it was a catfish. In my opinion, I think it was catfish too. The rod just went up and down and up and down. It was a huge bite. I got a bite. Probably a small fish, but it went away. It took my bait and it went away. Follow us on our next leg in Sedona. Thanks for watching.